Yo, it's your boy Dodie, and I'm back again, man. Part 19. Let's get it. Alright, so last time we was on here, we was doing the Ryujin Industries quest line, <laughs> and they put some stuff in my head to be able to control other people. So, I guess now they finna send me on a mission with said technology. So, uh, let's get to it. Good, you're here. I wasn't sure how accurate Vina's promise of no downtime was going to be. Let's just hope her promise of no brain damage holds true as well. Now that you've been outfitted with the internal neuroamp, it's time to put that tech to work. We're sending you into Infinity LTD. Lucas Drexler is about to learn exactly why you don't steal from Ryujin Industries. Oh, shoot up the place. I'll make him pay with his life. No, death is too good for our enemies. We prefer to teach them hard lessons and give them the rest of their lives to reflect on their mistakes. I'm gonna shoot Behind up the place. bars. All right, Yuko has provided a layout of Infinity LTD. You have two options for this assignment. We'll shoot be providing you with the means for or both. Shoot up the place. Option A. You gain entry through their maintenance access on the roof. I'm gonna walk through the front Option door B, and shoot up the place. We give you an assigned identity and arrange a meeting for you. I'll figure it out when I get there. As long as you're prepared when the time comes. Okay, I'm gonna walk, I'm now, gonna walk through the front door and presence, everybody gonna die. You'll either find yourself in the maintenance hallway or the marketing department. From there, you have three targets. First, you have Lucas Drexler's computer located in his office on the executive floor. Second is Faye Sengsavan's computer in research and development. And third, you need to obtain the prototype they are working on, also in R&D. As you can see, you've several floors to traverse. So I hope you're prepared for an adventure. My gun is. No problem, I got it. That's what we're counting on. Now. I had Ularu create a program that you need to run on both Lucas and Faye's computers. I'll let her explain the details. You see, once we expose Infinity LTD, all of their data is going to come under intense scrutiny. We only want the public to know about their mercenary hires and unauthorized human trials, but Project Dominion needs to remain confidential. I've created an overseer program that will gather all the evidence we need and at the same time delete anything relating to Ryujin and the internal Nero amp. So the public will never know Infinity LTD successfully stole from Ryujin Industries. Exactly. And what the public doesn't know doesn't hurt them. It is best to keep the public unaware of such a device. If the media were to draw their own conclusions, I'm certain they'd just create a panic among people. Controlling the narrative is of the utmost importance. Understood. Now we don't want to mess on this one. A body count will only distract from what we're trying to accomplish here. In fact, unless they're a master at being one with the shadows, I'd suggest you leave your friend behind. Lower the risk. Simon I'm going Reichlick to shoot up the place. I don't care about none of that shit y'all talk about. From the building. Sneaky shit is boring. I'm sure you remember him from Sidonia. Shut up talking to Infinity's me. Infinity's maintenance go. crew is understaffed. It's only a matter of time before pressure gauges go unchecked and they have a massive issue on their hands. Once that pressure becomes too much, blah, blah, blah. every floor in the building is going to suffer from gas leaks, setting off an automated alarm to evacuate the building. Can I go now? Simon was able to get a passcode talking, for you talking, to talking. access their system's computer, so you can force the heating system to fail. All right, I'll take it into consideration. Can I leave now? I'd highly advise you use it. This assignment isn't the time to test your abilities. The only thing you're out there to prove is that you can get this job done. I'm gonna get the job done, but I'm also doing it my way. Suit. It should help reduce their ability to detect you. These suits are typically reserved for the senior ranks, but we want to reduce as much risk as possible. What it look like? Suit or no suit, I'm gonna shoot up the place. And that's what we're hoping for. <laughs> if you can pull this off, even I'll be impressed. Once you've run the Overseer program and obtained the prototype, 
Your final step is to deliver the slate to David Barron at the SSNN field office. If he asks questions, feel free to give him just enough information to pique his interest, but no mention of Ryujin or who you are. SSNN is used to anonymous tips. They'll do whatever verifications they deem necessary on their own to confirm the story. Can y'all stop talking to me? It'll be the corporate story of the decade. It certainly will, and we'll have front row seats. So, any final questions before you go? No. Y'all went through that shit very thoroughly. Good luck, and be sure to report directly back to me when you return. Here's Simon's passcode, tell your operative what. suit, the I'm overseer try to do program, some sneaky shit. and your cover identity. And if they catch me, your cover I'm not ID leaving her at the door. If they entry leave, it, and yeah, 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 yeah. No, 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 So that's no. your ticket in, either way. Don't screw this up. If they shoot at me, Skyler it's gonna Lumen. be the same thing as before. Let's just leave it at that. I'll take them creds too. Are y'all gonna make them? I said I'm gonna take them creds. Alright. Dalton, what's up, Mike? Do you have the program? Yes, here it is. I hope you can find the evidence you need. I'm certain Ularu won't pass up this opportunity. I have no idea so, what the real plan is. I let's know take you. a look. Anyway. Aha. The decryptions hit a snag. There's definitely something here. This is exactly what we needed. According to this code, Ularu intended to plant false evidence that would show Masako was working with Lucas. The moment you launched the Overseer program, a series of fabricated communication files would have been uploaded to the Infinity LTD network. One of them even frames Masako for encouraging Lucas to push for early human trials. So it is clear what she intended. Now all that is left is to decide what to do with this information. I'm going to copy the necessary files off this slate and issue you a new one. I want to keep this one intact. So Alaru can't dispute it. All right. Now. We finally have the evidence we need to prove Olaru's guilt. Then it is time we use it. One down, one to go. Time to pay Infinity LTD a visit. Yes. I'm looking forward to putting this all behind us. Yeah, me too. We should Without go. that falsified evidence, Olaru is in for a big surprise. I fully expect she'll be eagerly awaiting SSNN's broadcast, anticipating Masako to be accused alongside Lucas Drexler. Here's the new slate with the revised Overseer program. Let's get this assignment finished the right way. Don't be nervous. You got this. Welcome to Infinity LTD's this corporate headquarters. Of Hello. Did you have an appointment with us today? Yep. Ah, yes, from Lumen Interactive. The elevator here will take you to the marketing floor. Once you arrive, you'll want to talk to Ellis Ortiz. He's the receptionist there and will be happy to help you. Shit, I already got this. Welcome to Infinity LTD's marketing department. That's you know me that you are on your way. Excuse me. Uh, sit down. Uh... I'll go notify Miss Hart that you're here. Feel free to use any of the facilities on the floor while you wait. The break room and bathrooms are just around the corner. What the fuck wrong with your pants, bro? Got them damn thunderstorms on.
Changing suspect. Yep. I want it. Take more than that. Shoot at me if you want to, bitch. You better take off running and go home. I cannot wait to kill you. Find a way into research and development. What is down there? You can't go in. You just can't. Administrations hey. come and go. I am glad there is still a reliable source of news in the settled systems, though. Can I help you? It often you? travels significantly slower than light. I think I have a news story you'd be very interested in. Well, I'll be the judge of that. What's this so-called story about? Maybe get you a ticket to a speaking gig he's got? That's all I can do. Find out for yourself. You Details are all on the sleep. Best. All right. I'll take a look. 
I don't suppose you want to tell me how you got this evidence. Nope. I can't reveal my sources. I'm sure as a reporter you understand that. Of course. I just hope your source is as reliable as you think they are. Maybe your friend here would care to comment? I see. Is there at least a name I can cite as my source? Man, come on, man. You know what the drill is. Why am I not surprised? As long as the evidence is adequate and verifiable, I expect it'll be aired within the hour, if not sooner. Now, if you'll excuse me, I obviously have some work to do. Damn, that's got all them fucking questions. All right, let's go in here and get cussed out by Masako. Hey! I believe you were specifically told that we did not want a body <laughs> count on this assignment. Hey, look, I said what I said. And if anyone was left alive, it should have been Lucas Drexler. I got the job done. I don't care about anything else you're talking about. Wrong. The execution matters just as much. I don't Something care. Something you should have learned by now. I don't care. All the tools you at your disposal, do. and yet here we are. I hope you at least attempted to use the internal neuroamp. Nope. Forgot I even had it. The deceased may think otherwise. So now it's just a waiting game for SSNN to break the news. Once the story airs, we have another board meeting scheduled to decide how to handle Infinity. Go ahead, Maeve. The SSNN broadcast has started. Shall I patch it through? Yes. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Citizens of New Atlantis were shocked today when an unidentified assailant assaulted the employees within the Infinity LTD building, leaving many dead, including Lucas Drexler, CEO. The murders are believed to be linked to a new investigation where Drexler would have been accused of numerous violations, including murder for hire, unauthorized human trials, and corporate theft. Authorities representing the UC and the Freestar Collective have been dispatched to a consolidated mining station and the clinic. Both locations are believed to hold numerous victims. Drexler's motivation appears to be an attempt to launch a new product based off stolen information from a competitor. The details on the project itself and the competitor have yet to be confirmed. This has been David Barron for SSNN. Perfect. This exposure puts infinity right where we want them. Hey, the meeting will begin momentarily, but I want you to discuss the options we have with the other members. Infinity's net worth is about to hit rock bottom. So this gives us the opportunity to win a little more public faith. I don't care what y'all do. Why am I shit gonna buy them out? Quite right. The truth is, we'll be making evaluations. I don't care. No. We'll shed any employees who don't make the cut, slowly but surely. Blah, blah, blah. By incorporating Infinity, we eliminate a competitor, get their best employees and contracts, and all while boosting our public perception. I suppose it is all very simple when you do not consider the impact on actual human lives. Just your bottom line. A oh, corporation like Ryujin can shape any employee into a valuable one. That's certainly our hope. Any employee with a sense of drive is sure to show themselves. I yeah, just can't shape me. Which is why I'd like you to talk to the board to convince them this is the right move. I don't want to. There are several who might disagree, and you have the perfect tool to help sway them. Are oh, you talking about my gun? What are you talking about my gun? They'll be on your side. I know I can. Of the benefits. I know you can as well. So now you're fully aware of my expectations. You'll find most of the board members in their offices preparing. Vina is also here, waiting for the meeting to start. We'll need at least 50% of the vote to go our way. In the event of a tie, I will make the final decision. I trust you'll get it done. all these damn dots I gotta go talk to, man. Shit, I mean, come on with this shit. 
Watch them awards on the wall. I'm going to take them bitches. What's this? Oh, I'll be back. So much work to do. I can't take them. All right, everyone. As you all know, we've successfully exposed Infinity LTD's botched human trials and murder for hire through SSNN. The public is outraged. Had Lucas not been a casualty in our plans, I'm sure they'd be demanding his head. Ryujin will be launching a statement, but I believe now is the perfect time to acquire Infinity LTD. I got nothing to say. Believe it or not, I agree. The acquisition has risks, and it's going to create a lot of work for all of us. But the overall payoff will be worth it. That, and Infinity LTD's current situation, makes them more affordable than ever. Arguments? Acquiring Infinity LTD now is not a good look. Especially if the public believes Masako was involved. I think what we're all overlooking is what led us to this situation to begin with. Yes, our security was compromised. But considering Dalton was hired by Masako, the issue obviously starts at the top. In fact, I propose that Masako be removed from CEO altogether. Ulan, Hello, well. this isn't a line you want to cross. Join and considering so you're fire. the mole, if anyone's going to be removed from power, it's going to be you. Yeah. Hold up. Are you saying you lied to us? Dalton, the last meeting we had, you distinctly said Imogen was the mole, and she'd been dealt with. Imogen was just another victim. Ularu set her up. Do you even have any proof to back up this outrageous claim? What of course think? we do. The malicious code you hid on this slate to upload incriminating evidence against Masako onto Lucas Drexler's computer. To put it bluntly, Ularu, you're fired. Security will hold you in your office until a proper exit interview can be done. This isn't right. I should at least have the opportunity to resign. And allow you to still be marketable to a competitor? I don't think so. This may be news to me, and I will be reviewing the evidence closely. But this isn't something you just get to walk away from. You're finished here, bitch. Security, escort Miss Chen to her office and see that she stays put. You'll regret this, all of you. I'll give you I, I believe see the you only the regret will be trusting so, you to begin worry with. Worry all right, back to business. All in favor of acquiring Infinity LTD? Aye. Aye. All against? Nay. Good. Alexis, start drawing up the necessary documentation. Anyone have anything else they'd like to bring up? Nope. Any other matters to bring forth? None? This concludes our order of business for today. So, Infinity LTD learned a lesson the hard way, and we exposed the traitor among us. You've proven yourself to be quite the asset here at Ryujin. Yep. Of course. But these particular assignments required a certain secrecy that most do not. I truly appreciate the work you put in to exposing Ularu. No operative has ever had to investigate our own to the extent that you did. I can imagine it may have been a lot of pressure, considering you were fairly new at the time. No, it was actually very fucking boring. Imogene's instincts were right about you. Now, as promised, I have your bonus. I hope you'll find it appropriate for all you've done. And I'm promoting you to senior operative. You've more than earned it. I don't want to work here no more. Thank you. It's well deserved. As for the details, I think someone back on the operations floor would prefer to explain those to you.
What's up, Shawty? You've certainly shaken things up around here. You know what I'm I still can't believe Ularu tried to frame me. An obvious misjudgment on my part. Yeah. But now that's all in the past. It's time to get back to your typical day to day. It's good to see you back in the office. And I'd say it's good to be back if I hadn't returned to a mountain of paperwork. Now, since you were new, you've been dealing with people, but most of our assignments are generated on the mission board. The board holds any available assignments that our techs have pieced together and I've approved. Questions? No, I'm good. I'm not finna do that shit. Good. The mission board is generally self-explanatory anyway. With your promotion, you've earned yourself an office, so whenever you're ready, you can find your own personal mission board inside. I got an office. And the best Ooh. perk of them all, you're free to make your own hours. Yep. Yeah, oh, never and uh, congratulations, of course. Thanks. Bye. You certainly will. Go check out the board. And if you have any questions, I suppose I can start up an open door policy just for you. I'm not going to miss you, Lottie. I can still see that smug look on her face. It's my office, little bitty ass office. I won't, I won't. What's this? Oh. Hey, if you made it to this part of the video, I just want to say thank you for watching the video and please comment, like, and subscribe.